Hi and welcome to MTG Managed Crew. And for cons of Takia, I decided to do a video on all the promo cards available. And first off, from your buyer box promo, we have our Rather Claw Mystic, a really really nice card. Definitely uh, playable, I would think so. 2 1 human shaman creature for 1 and green. You can tap to add green, blue, or red to your mana pool with a morph. So when it is turned face up, you add green, blue, and red to your mana pool as well. So really, really awesome. It's like a third turn, fourth turn, yeah, fourth turn, six mana. And it's a really, really crazy uh, card in promo. But personally, I think I like the non-promo version better. It is uh, way, way cooler than the promo version. Yeah, the promo version just looks like some adorable ant or <laughs> something jumping around. So there you go. Rather claw mystic, but still a really, really good card. And I'm uh, looking forward to having this. And moving on. And for next, we have our game day promo. And for participation in games day, kind of kind of talk here, we have Air of the Wow, a 2-2 human warrior creature for 1 and green with death touch and ferocious whenever it attacks. If you control a creature with power 4 or greater, it gets plus 1, plus 1 until end of turn. Really, really good card. Uh, I think one of the cards, one of the participation cards that is really usable. So Air of the Wilds on the left is the normal version and on the right is the alternate art promo and I think on the, the right card is so 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 much cooler. It's very very gritty uh, image and art style. You can see the creature walking on snow and there's like tons of blood stain on the snow as well so really really awesome. And for the next card it is Utter End. It is what you'll get if you when top 8 in cons of Takia Games Day. So really cool and you get this in alternate art and in foil as well. It's an instant spell for 2 white and black. Exile target non-land permanent. A really huge card in uh, cons of Takia. Exiling target non-land permanent means you can basically destroy sort of anything without worrying if it is indestructible or not. You can exile Planeswalker just for 4 mana. I think this is really really cool. And again on the left uh, it is your normal version and on the right it is your promo version. And let's move on to the next promo that you will get in Cans of Takia. And so the next one that you can get is on launch day which is uh, 26 September. Yep, 26 September. You'll get your legendary artifact equipment, Dragon Throne of Tarkia, just by going for the launch date itself. You'll get this. It is a artifact when equipped creature has defender and you can pay to tap other creature you control gains trample and get plus X plus X until end of turn where X is that creature's power with equipped cost 3. So really really cool, very very nice art you can see. Uh, who's that guy? Zergo? If I'm not wrong, can't remember his name. The Khan from Madu clan. And there you go. These are all the four promo cards that you can get in uh, Khans of Tarkia block. Uh, of course, the intro packs have their own alternate art as well this time. So, pretty cool. You could check them out and get yourself one. And that's it for this video. We hope you like the series so far. And as always, like this channel, please do hit like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.